All right, you guys, back here with Sparrow Martin, back with another video. You already know that I'm finna be speaking so real dope. I know y'all wondering why I'm not in my spot. You know, I'm at my sister's house right now. You know, I've been chilling at my sister's house right now because you know, I'm waiting for my mom to come home, but you already know I'm finna be speaking so real dope. So before we get into this video, how was your day? How you feel? How you feel? Like every day you wake up in the morning, you gotta feel good. You gotta feel good about yourself. I don't care, regardless of anybody that talk about you, regardless of anything, regardless of what's going on in this earth, you have to think about yourself. You have to feel good about yourself every day you wake up in the morning. But yeah, man, further ado, let's get into this video. But y'all see the caption, y'all see the name, y'all see anything that linked up to anything what I'm finna be say, y'all already know what I'm finna be talking about. This coronavirus shit, man. I'm tired. I'm tired of it. <laughs> I'm so tired of this shit. Like, for real, bro. Y'all have to understand. It's a reason why they doing this. It's a reason. And y'all folks, y'all bots, y'all anything they call them. I don't care how I call y'all folks. I don't care. It's a reason why they doing this. For y'all people that's not woke. For y'all people that's, you know, stay on the news, watching the news, feel bad and all this. It's for y'all people. Y'all are creating this reality. This coronavirus and stuff, it's not even real, bro. All this is just a fake for, to me, though. That's my opinion. Don't take it serious and comment down below all this bull crap. You can't do what you got to do because you watch my video still. Been one minute past. Thank you for that one minute. Leave the video. But this my opinion. Like, it's fake. Like, bro, every day for the last week, how long this coronavirus be going on? I've been sitting in the crib or been doing me for the longest. Just looking at this, looking at y'all scared of the coronavirus, looking at y'all. I'm just looking at, I'm looking down at y'all just like, bro, seriously, you sitting over here scared of the coronavirus, talking about it. When you, you blessed, you wake up in the morning, you have the health that God gave you every day. So why is you keep... Like, why is you so scared of the coronavirus? Like, what's going on, bro? Why? Why do you fear? Just because it's in your area? That's why they, they, they said it was in your area. That's what they said. Everything that goes on in the media, everything that goes on on the news, y'all believe it. Donald Trump can say that a meter or anything that can come down and blow this earth up or everybody going to have cancer, y'all will believe that. Y'all will believe it, right? They control all this. Everything that's around us, everything. They control every single thing. They control the weather. So why do you think they can control your mind and your your thoughts or whatever? We are dealing in the like we are dealing in crisis right now. This is a whole different dimension. We are not even from this dimension, and we are on this earth full of money eaters and all this and what. Bro, if they can control the weather, if they can control what we think, if they can control the things that we on, devices or anything, what do you think they can, like, bro, this is the news we are talking about. The new, all it, all it takes is one thing, a, a little tiny proof to get these black folks or anybody shook up to be scared of this coronavirus or anything. They can, tomorrow they can come out with a new disease to scare everybody away. But in reality, it's not even fake. I mean, in reality, it's not even real. Like, come on, bro. It's some of y'all that's living y'all best lives. Some of y'all that got money and everything. Y'all sitting over here scared of the coronavirus. Come on, bro. Live in the moment. Stop living on your phone. Stop letting other people tell you, you know, what is going on. You are the news. Tell people how you feel. You wake up in the morning with a blessed heart. You wake up in the morning feeling good. Everybody can't wake up in the morning every day. Express that. Tell everybody that you woke up in the morning and you feel good. That coronavirus ain't hitting me yet. Word. Like, what I'm saying, man, y'all gotta y'all gotta think, man. Y'all gotta think. They controlling all this media. Donald Trump gonna be president. Remember that, bro. Donald Trump gonna be president. They say he impeached. But I promise you. Look, look, listen, listen, listen to me. Listen. I peep it. I peep it. Once like, this coronavirus is here for a reason. This year wasn't even here for three months. 
It haven't even been six months or whatever. It's only been three months and they already coming out with some boys, some boy stuff. Coronavirus, bro. Come on, bro. Why they why they didn't come out with 2019? Why they listen, listen, why did they not come out with the coronavirus 2019? Why? Why? Why it had to be this year? Why? This year is special for all y'all folks that love to be on y'all device, that love to, you know, listen to the news and pay attention to what's going on. I mean, I ain't gonna lie. I be on my phone 24-7. I ain't gonna lie. But I don't pay attention to that news stuff. I don't pay attention to what's going on. I live in the moment. Everything was going on in front of me. I live in that. That's life. I see it how it is. I feel healthy, but you know, I don't eat, I don't eat healthy. I don't, you know, as far as they say, like the coronavirus and stuff, I'm healthy. I don't eat healthy, I eat bad foods, but you know, I'm sitting here normal with a hat on, with some clothes on my feet, my body, and I'm looking at y'all, talking to y'all, and you looking at me, you healthy. So why are you complaining? Why are you so scared of the coronavirus? That stuff don't matter. Stop being scared. As long as you waking up in the morning feeling good, you are good, bro. And listen, listen, listen to me. Listen, next month, next month, listen, I'm predicting this, bro. Next month, nah, 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 not next month. On election day or anything, Donald Trump will be president again. And I promise you, he will save the day. He will give up. He, he might, he might give the cures to coronavirus or he might just end coronavirus pure point blank like everything's blown off he gonna do that and then y'all black folks or y'all human beings will praise him he will he will y'all be like dang donald trump really care about us because you know he gave us the cure to um coronavirus or he ended coronavirus then now he gonna be the president again it's all a game they they did that for us they got this big they got this big table, you know, where they sit at that table or a facility and they sit there and they chill and they talk about how, like anything, they talk about anything they can do to, you know, make the society vote for Donald Trump or anybody that can destroy this earth. Bro, seriously, if they can control the weather, why do you, what, bro, if they can control the weather, and make you feel like, oh, all right, it's going to rain and all this. It's nothing serious. It's just life. No, they are controlling the weather. This this weather is fake. This weather is fake. All this is fake. Everything we own is fake. We are not from this earth. We are born from God. God put us on this earth for a reason to find our happiness, not to let all this bull crap distract us from our happiness. Bro, seriously. The coronavirus is distracting us for being happy. We can't even wake up in the morning and feel good. Soon we get on the phone. Listen, listen, listen. Soon we get on the phone. It's a new, it's a new news. It's something new about the coronavirus that's taking over. Something new that make our day just messed up the whole day. Bro, seriously, I caught myself just looking at the um the news. I, I listen, I caught myself looking at the YouTube coronavirus stuff and it actually made me scared but i had to think about it like bro i am living right now i'm paying whoa well, i'm living in the moment i feel good so why is i'm scared of this it's all, all this in my mind bro what's going on bro seriously it, you create your own bro like just stop being scared y'all be wearing this mask on and stuff like bro it's homeless people out there that touch everything in the world Got to feel the fresh breeze, everything. Why Why they don't got the coronavirus? It's homeless people out here that touch everything in the world, touch dirty stuff and all that. They don't wash their hands. Why they don't got the coronavirus? And they throwing all this in our face. All these human beings, they got phones and all that. They throwing it in our face. It's a reason keep us scared to keep us on the lowest vibration and once we on the lowest vibration we are easy to control y'all gotta know y'all worth y'all gotta know what y'all dealing with these is real life gods people that can actually control this this earth 
and they in plain sight. You can see them. Everything happens in plain sight. Everything they doing is in plain sight. Back then they was they was not noticeable, but now it's in plain sight. You can see everything, but people don't question life. People don't question why did they make the coronavirus? Notice if the coronavirus is real, the government made it. I don't even believe in the government really. It's no government. Like it's all planned out. Everything life is planned out. Oh. Yeah, we finna um drop this coronavirus so these black people can be scared and all this and that. Bro, literally, these white people is just looking at us, laughing at us. They healthy. They got all the money. They not scared of nothing. Bro, y'all got to use y'all minds, bro. Y'all got to think. Think for real. Question life. Question why is this coronavirus and all this and that. Why is I'm so scared of the coronavirus when I'm sitting here watching this video or anything, bro? Live in a moment. I don't care. You could you could be on your phone. But I mean, if you if you know that it's gonna scare you, why would you watch the video? Why? If you know the coronavirus is gonna mess up your day by even talking, why? Why are you watching the video? Man, listen. It's a, it's a matter of time. This world is going to end. It's going to be a big apocalypse. The world's just going to go on crazy. People don't even know themselves no more. We are robots. We are working for the white people. Lots of technology around, flying cars, all this. It's a matter of time. And it's not even, it's, it's our own people that's building this. Black human beings. We are promoting this type of stuff, bro. These rappers, they promoting this, bro. Us human beings is doing it to ourselves. Bro, I ain't even gonna lie, though, bro. Y'all not the only person, bro. I sin, too, bro. I do bad things, too. I eat bad food. I'm a human being, too. I be on my phone 24-7 like a bot. But I know. I know. I know my worth I know that nothing can come between myself and my happiness. I'm that I'm stressed and depressed too. Y'all not the only people, but I know the reason why I'm stressed and depressed. So it's my fault. I'm not blaming nobody. Everything is my fault and everything is your fault. You can't blame nobody. You can't blame no phone. You can't blame no mom. You can't blame nobody. Because at the end of the day, you is you. You have to go to sleep at night feeling this pain. You got to do all this and that. Stop blaming people. That's you. That's your decisions. So, yeah. Matter of time, this world going to end. Life is going to get wild. It's going to be a big apocalypse. Us, us human beings going to be robots. And I'm not even talking about real robots, but it's going to be like technology robots. We're going to live on our phones. We're going to use our phones to, you know, Siri. This and that. And I'm just telling y'all ahead of time. Because I can die tomorrow. I can die this week. I can die at a young age. I don't know when I'm going to die. Because nobody knows when they're going to die. So I'm just telling y'all now. So y'all can remember my videos and watch this for real. Because I this video right here. I'm not even doing it for the money. I'm just telling y'all bro. Because I don't even post like that on YouTube. Don't worry. Because you know I be chilling doing me. Because I got to take this stuff a break a little bit. My views still go up. My minutes still go up. My hours still go up. So I'm just chilling. But at the same time, bro, you have to get it together. This life is no game, bro. We are doing it to ourselves at that. Us human beings, bro. But I love y'all to, to the core, bro. And we out.